Hi, I'm Tim. Just got word today is July 25th, 2023. The first FAA freeze have been approved. Let's get to it. As part of the FAA's remote ID program, one of the ways in which you can fly without remote ID is in a FRIA or an FAA recognized identification area. Per the act, FRIAs are requested by community-based organizations, in our case, the Academy of Model Aeronautics. The AMA will forward that to the FAA. The FAA will review the field, and if approved, you have a FRIA status. The important thing, if you're lucky enough to fly with an AMA club, there's about 2,500 clubs, flying clubs out there, if a FRIA is approved, when remote ID kicks in, becomes effective on September 16th, 2023, you do not need any equipment whatsoever to fly your model and still be, as a recreational flyer, completely compliant with remote ID. Again, in a FRIA, recreational pilots can fly their RC models, any type, and they're compliant with remote ID. As I've said in several videos, the FRIA approval process is on track. There's just a lot of stuff that had to be done. The latest hiccup was a um, required environmental review that delayed everything until the first uh, week or so of July before the FAA could offer free approval. That has happened. I've known for a little while that some FRIAs were approved because our club field here in Georgia does have their FRIA, FRIA approval. The AMA came out today with the official notification. So we've got a little less than two months before the September 16th date. I would expect a lot more FRIAs to come out. Some FRIAs are getting denied. For example, there was one club, the address for the field, even though it was in the middle of a field, the address that was on the map was the gate, which is right next to a hospital. The FRIA got denied. So there's still some things that'll have to be worked out, but free approvals are coming through. Clubs are getting them, and that'll be a huge plus for the flyers that can fly at an AMA field. No equipment required at all for recreational RC aircraft flying. Thank you for joining me in this video, and I look forward to further updates for the remote ID and electric RC flight in general. Thank you.